anybody. I know. What are we doing? Mope was with me, but... I can't do this alone. We should try to find them. We know who we're supposed to be. We just need to get there. I hated Rip back to the other one, but she's okay now. I'm still gonna kill off Sarah though. <laughs> Maybe they're thinning out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? Oh shit. Oh god. No. Sneeze, sorry. Stay close. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. Wow, so smart. Sorry, the mic keeps cutting in and out. My allergies. Should be okay now. But damn, I hope Kenny's okay. Maybe I shouldn't have cut off Sarita's arm. Volume and quality okay, everyone? I meant audio quality. We need to keep going. Yeah, you need to keep going. We're almost there, right? I hope so. It's getting so damn cold. Wish I could stop. Not until we're with the others. We need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah. Fuck Amy. Sarah. Forget about her. Alright, audio check. Hold on. Seriously, fuck Sarah. Fuck Sarah. Forget about her. Alright, audio check. Hold on. Alright, cool. That went well. If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? We're fine. It's been quiet, but who knows? 
Don't worry. We're okay. I don't know how to act to Rebecca anymore. I don't hate her as much. We'll at least be safe, I guess. We need to keep up a good pace. I know. I know. Just I'm going as fast as I can. We'll go faster. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. How could I leave Alvin behind? It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. The plan worked. We got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course, Fuck Sarah. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. I have to stop. I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can, Can we leave you here? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Can we just leave her there? Leave her here? Let's get the fuck out. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Just, uh, how pregnant are you? <laughs> I don't want to be stuck out here. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. Huh. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food. And, you know, other stuff. Yeah. And? And... There are just some helpless things in this world. You can't always protect them. And you assume I won't be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Shit, I didn't mean it. Shit. Jane, wait. Yo, follow her. Can I follow her? Please. <laughs> Fucking Rebecca, man. Shut the fuck up. No one likes you. We can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. It had been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Uh huh. Besides, how's Kenny? I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. Started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. It was scary. I've been nervous to even go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? The way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. He's not acting rationally. I've seen Kenny like this before. He's like a good. I don't know. Snap out of it. I think so. Eventually. Clem, I was thinking now that you're here, maybe you could go talk to him. That's cool. Kenny's my boy. I'll okay. do it. Hope he doesn't flip out on me. Sarita, wherever you are, please forgive me. I can't be alone again. Hi, Kenny. <laughs> you think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? What's wrong with Kenny? 
Why is Kenny acting that way? Do you think Kenny's okay? It's all I hear from anyone anymore. Kenny, I'm so sorry about Sarita. Sorry, huh? Well, that's nice of you, seeing as this was your fault in the first place. What? There was nothing I could do. Seeing how things turned out, I think I might have preferred you do nothing. I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? Whoa, it's easy, man. Chill. It works. Not for the last time. Just get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to bounce back. That man's going through. At least you try. Still, it doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're going to do now. We got no food, no water, it's getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. We thought Kenny would have a plan. Mike, honey. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. What, suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? Seeing you people floundering the minute things don't go according to plan has just got me on edge, all right? We should go find Luke and Sarah. Oh, if fuck. If we're in trouble, we might be able to help them. Clementine's right. After everything, after all this, if there's any chance they're still alive, we need to take it. Fuck Sarah, I'll okay. Go. Clem can come with me. Oh, I should have suggested that shit. I want to save Luke, but I really don't want to save Sarah. Thank you. God. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to. I don't know, but you better keep that close. Come hey, on, Clem. How many shots you got in that? Look, I'm a level with you. You should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. That's cool. That's cool. Well, then why'd we come out here? I wanted to talk to you, away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still, I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before, and, well, a lot of times, it's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny going to be? What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken decisions. Have you just kept to yourself this whole time? Of course not. But sometimes you gotta learn the hard way. I'm trying to save you that trouble. Huh. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew. But groups most. fall apart. People get killed. Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it. 